I know what you're looking at. It's a horrible short. I think nothing is more necessary than this conversation. Where are the shoes? <laughs> <laughs> This short has everything in it. We hate, we hate love. Romance. We, we hate, hate romance. romance. It's true, unless it's two dudes. <laughs> you son of a gun. You made it. Of course I did. I still have shame when I watch it. <laughs> <laughs> How spooky. Oh my god, this feels awesome. We can just come whenever we want. And my uncle doesn't have to decide anymore. <laughs> Oh no. oh no! Oh no, I can barely no. see what's happening! Kevin, do you want to intro this? I would love to intro video. this video. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to our uh, to our Uncle Mickey React videos. This one we're doing, it's it's one of our short films again. And it, it is, we're, it's the next step of our evolution. Before we kind of did our very early, like experimental, short, whatever. These ones, while they were still for our community college this, These uh, were the classes, first big swings. These are the big ones, the big swings. Yep. Yeah, so we're going to be looking at um, our original three. Each of us had kind of more or less directed this, one. This was Uncle yeah. Mickey, the next phase. Yeah. Yes. This is Uncle Mickey phase one yeah. that you're watching right yeah, now. Yeah, And it is just as bad, if not worse, than the last one. <laughs> it's it's worse in very different it, ways. It's worse in the fact that we are... We tried we, harder. We tried harder, yeah. went further, pushed harder on everything. And failed harder. And failed harder <laughs> because of it. Ridley's been acting... Unusual lately. Something's changed. I've been feeling different lately. What's going on? What happened, Lucas? I don't know what's out there. I don't care. I know what Nemesis means. Maybe it'll give us an idea of what it is. Oh, and we still didn't know how to spell Uncle Mickey. We hadn't figured I, it out. I think it might actually be spelled differently in each one of these, I yeah. think. Yeah, that was the bit in the beginning. Yeah. Evolve Corporations has transformed a pit of failed economies into one global economy. Stock footage. We gotta credit that kid. I wonder where he's at now. Probably 40 years old. Building the world of tomorrow, today. Camera, audio. We had people recording audio. Well, just that shot we did. Hello and whatnot. That wouldn't count. What is this We're music? Part. About what body part we could lose? Why is it Blue's Clues music? Hey, we got a composer to do the music. This music? Actually, <laughs> what the fuck are you talking we got a, You don't remember that? <laughs> no. This is the only no. time we got a composer. Oh, no, you're right. No, they, the composer didn't do this, though. Yes, he did. He did. He did. <laughs> yes, he did. He did, 100%. He, did. Dude. he composed it. He was a composer, as you know. He composed it. Oh, God. <laughs> the, I'm not actually going to relinquish, though. I, the composer could have very easily just ripped something from the royalty free <laughs> library. Sure. And he's like, they won't be able to tell the difference. This thing sucks, anyways. Really, come on. You've got to have an opinion on this. I think nothing is more necessary than this conversation. Where are the shoes? <laughs> We, I, I still quote that to this it day. Is so it's, it's so terrible. Uh, I'll look to you if the state of your room hasn't changed recently. Ridley's been acting unusual lately. I know I'm not the only one that's noticed. Yeah, you should. There is too much space in between each action, you stupid editor. <laughs> Hey! Why is he acting strange? Oh, it's Laser Greg's room. It's Laser Greg's room. All you, you Greggies. All you, all you <laughs> Lasers out there. Uh, was all of this music really in their original cut? You know what's so sad? When <clears throat> when it came time for for, for the recut, I, I took it out. I put in royalty free. <laughs> the irony <laughs> is I put in royalty free music and I liked it more. Ooh, that is a very, a very blurry, very dark exposed shot. exposed shot. Look. <laughs> What a sound effect. That's a sweet royalty free sound effect right there. Hey, and now I don't see anything. Now be prepared to not be able to see anything for the rest of the short film. I can see that. Lucas? Kevin, why is why is Lucas named Lucas? I'd rather not say. Is it George yeah. Lucas? No. I hate you so much. Every character is named after somebody. and It's Kevin Project. He does it every time. It's every, every name. Oh, Her name's God. Ridley. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> How spooky. 
So man. fun fact, he's the most famous person in any martial arts. That we've arts. ever worked with. <laughs> ever. Yeah. The monster he, man. He is in Godzilla, Godzilla King of the Monsters, the yeah. new movie. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> that's like uh, that's like a perfect and then they named me the chief splash <laughs> if only this was a comedy oh uh, so that kevin I'll, I'll give kevin credit here it doesn't look great but it's on like on like when kevin pitched that idea like oh we don't need to throw a bunch of blood in the water if we have it darkly lit and we put a curtain in there for a brief moment it'll look like he's just This is not edited for comedic effect. That is the actual level of the dialogue. Where's the emergency dial? Another <laughs> Kevin trope is Kevin loves when characters finish each other's sentences. Yeah, yeah, classic. I think me and Alec have beaten it out of him, yeah. but he still loves it. I don't think it's that. Legitimately bad. though, that is great. That shot. It's not bad. It's not bad. <laughs> I like that shot. I know what Nemesis means. Maybe it'll give us an idea of what it is. Oh my god, you had to Google it. Nemesis is the Greek goddess of divine retribution and vengeance. Every <laughs> single <laughs> Uncle Mickey project has a scene where characters explain everything. We had that shot and then we don't have any Insert shots of the doors actually closing. No sound electronically There's of no why it's happening. Like, it, yeah. <laughs> it's just like, why did that happen? It's just, they're, they're just like, the that's weird. The house is also anyway, haunted. The house is haunted. <laughs> oh, no. oh no. Oh no, I can barely no. see what's happening. I love that shot because so the, the chair moved. That only moved because I was there and I pulled it. That was perfect. Yeah, that's that was perfect. Oh, there we are. There Were are those boys. jump cuts? So Why does he have the Declaration of Independence? Because he's American, dude. Because he's human. And probably American. <laughs> Oh, Kevin, do you want to briefly explain, now that the short is over, what the plot of this short uh, film is? Yeah, so basically they're all robots. Uh, they're all humanoid That's androids. That's the plot twist. Hold at on, the end. we don't know they're robots yet. Don't give it away. My like, blood is not red, it's blue. It's, it's a blue. blue. What? Look That's at his weird. guts. He's he oh, got robot look at those guts. awful effects. Your friends. Having developing emotions. You especially. Oh god. This is the this has two scenes <laughs> where they describe everything. You know the secret to their existence and extinction will be kept indefinitely. I mean, okay, I know he's supposed to be robotic, and that is completely our fault in telling him what to do. Um, it is also terrible. <laughs> Kevin <laughs> Mix. Oh, man. Also, I'm pretty sure, Samsa, you did not know how to center text. I, yeah, no, well, of course not. I didn't because know Because I, I was just like, I those, those are not. up there. I was like, some of them were centered. Nemesis is like up here. Who, who this is, is down there. supposed to be? Like a reference to? Yeah. Do you want to know? Stanley Kubrick. Oh, I don't even know why Dummy. I asked. That awkward space that if isn't in the other. If I could re-edit Nemesis, I'll tell you exactly what I'd do. <laughs> I'd cut out my name at the end, and then that's it. <laughs> I, that's Lighting a... by Brian? That's what he got? Yeah. But Brian made a joke out of it. <laughs> Look at Brian's last name! Velasquez! Velasquez! Ooh. Yeah. Well, we did always spell it wrong. <laughs> yeah, no, we know. Turn it off. <laughs> Oh God, all right, um, so Nemesis. That is, I think the thing that makes Nemesis so bad is that we we were not 15 when we made it. We weren't 16, we weren't even 17 or 18. We were all 20. We were all 20. I think the most embarrassing thing about it is it is so bad 
for even the resources yeah. that we had. It, you guys should go back and watch it raw because you'll really get the full effect. It is, it's, I still have shame when I watch it. I, yeah. I still have so much shame. It's so terrible. It makes me laugh. But with this, it's like, man, we really tried. It is so yeah. funny that we did not succeed. Yeah. And it was the first time we'd ever worked with Brian as an actor. We had met him kind of in this semester. And so he showed up in Nemesis. And so when we went to make our next short, Brian was like, oh, I I'm an actor. We'd kind of seen him do some stuff. And we had only worked with the actors that we'd worked with on Nemesis. Those were the only actors that we had ever worked with. Seeing Brian do some stuff, we were kind of blown away. We were like, whoa. Wow. He, say, he <laughs> says things loud. Oh my God. Dude, he who? can talk quietly and loud. <laughs> So Brian was game changing. Brian was game changing. Ooh, okay. It was the start of a collaboration that would last years. We gotta move on to we the, to the next short sure. film. I almost jumped off. A bridge? Yeah. There's something going on with me. I found a suicide note in my apartment. I think I'm trying to kill myself. You're the reason I have to kill myself. Oh, Evil Dead shot. You can tell I really like The Evil Dead. There's a lot of things you can tell that you really liked when you watch this movie. That nice. was a good match cut! That was a good match This cut. is all great. No, it isn't. This <laughs> I have always I liked like that this shot. Held. I've always liked it's this shot held. specifically. I hate this. <laughs> There's that play. There's me. I almost jumped off. A bridge? Yeah. I must have gotten really drunk. Were you there? Oh, uh, writing characters that get there? drunk. I, we, we had not. I, I don't. At this point, I'd had like maybe four drinks in my entire life. I must have gotten I got really so drunk. drunk. I was jump off. Why are you laughing? <laughs> what? It's funny. I got so drunk, I was going to jump off a bridge. <laughs> <laughs> no one does that. No one gets so drunk that they end up on a fucking bridge. Ooh, that, was, yeah. that was not a good fucking. No. <laughs> what is he working on? That it's is hammering. We didn't add a sound effect to even try to help it. It was just like. You ever been up to Monterey? No. What, dude? That city's a literal shit. So this scene is something that plagues a lot of stupid people's films, and that is that we wrote it to be a dinner scene, but it was daytime <laughs> when we filmed it. So we tried doing day for night, and day for night just meant that we shut the blinds to make it seem like it was evening, but then they're the eating waffles and eggs. <laughs> also, that is so many waffles. Talking about, it's beautiful there, and they have the best clam chowder. And the and homeless people, and then the parking, and the hippies, and the homeless hippies. We thought that was so funny. We thought that was very funny. Will you call me tomorrow after work? Of course. Brian had the first and only on-screen Uncle Mickey kiss until our most recent project. In we, we hate, hate love. Romance. We, we hate, hate romance. romance. It's true. Unless it's two dudes. <laughs> Unless it's two dudes. It's true. It's hard to tell, but in certain shots, you can clearly see the camera person in the mirror. I think that's also a script on the counter. Another match cut. Another I, match I really cut. like the match cut. I love those match yeah. cuts. Yeah. I don't remember anything. I don't remember a single thing leading up to either of those situations. Well, why do you want to kill yourself? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's man. clear that no one that wrote this has ever been to a therapist before. Well, what if I told you? That you've been here before. We did not write that line like that because he's black. That was in the script before the character was black. Because we told him, deliver it like Morpheus from the Matrix, and he said, what is like, that? We specific Because he had a lot of trouble with that line, and we specifically were like, oh, just say it exactly like this. And he was like, that's really great. Who is that? Who are you talking what about? What is the Matrix? <laughs> like you've never seen the Matrix? This is when you realize... How much left? We are not, no. we are, we are, we are eight, eight and eight, nine minutes in. <laughs> we are not even I've half. been here for an hour. <laughs> are you serious? Hey, what was that jump cut? Jump cut. If we were to pause at every jump cut, dude, we will be here for the, the rest of our lives. That's a jump <laughs> Oh no. I never noticed that. I hate these people. I, I, I'm gonna say it again. I hate the people that made this. 
I'm going to say this is my unironic favorite <laughs> shot in this entire short film. I think this no, is so no, no, fucking no. It, funny. It, it, it is great. <laughs> Brian is sipping a coffee, and then behind him, there's just a man trying to get through the door that's hey, not locked. The apple. There's me. Product. There's like Sam it, Slater. I'm playing a, a, a horrible character of a homeless man. <laughs> hey, you want to buy a churro? No. <laughs> no. No. Thank you. I, I Why don't. is this here? I don't. <laughs> We're so stupid. What, you too good for churros? I quote that line constantly. What, you think you're too, you're good, too good for, for churros? churros? <laughs> <laughs> that was an added sound effect, was the punk. <laughs> so yeah, we just had My, a Where we explained everything. And now Kevin has to come in and explain everything again. I know you put things on yourself, but I just, I want you to know it wasn't your fault. I wish I was dead. <laughs> How was it? Me too. <laughs> I you wish Kevin was dead. It's more important to me than some bitch. I am so you're fucking terrible. You are terrible, but I'm also so the dialogue bad. is The dialogue garbage. is so no, terrible. No, 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 no. The dialogue is really bad. I think that George would, George would really appreciate this. Is this going to be one of our repeated I should go jokes? I have to. Yes. All right, I've accepted it. What? what? <laughs> <laughs> that was like the most gone. effort we put into anything yeah, at the we, time. We, we like, were... we moved that couch. Oh, there he is. There's Sam Slade. Here's the payoff to all those setups. There's Eat Kevin's your heart out, Jordan again. Peele. Also, You're the reason I haven't been able to kill myself. Everything in it. <laughs> you can tell in several shots that he's just holding the sword. Fuck. Why is the music so loud? The only reason I'm here is because you're incapable of seeing the bright side of things. What bright side? What well, Mark did. Now we're now we're explaining it again for the fourth time. I'm not, for, I'm not forcing you to not kill yourself, okay? And I'm not hindering your happiness, okay? I chose to be happy. Oh, yeah, the you message of this that. is suicide is bad, dude. Yeah. You should always find a purpose to live, Suicide dude. is dude, God, bad. It was you literally it. pitched as, it's a wonderful life versus meets Fight Club. And I remember at the time, you guys were so convinced. You were like, we will have footage. Of it's a wonderful life featured in it. He will be watching it because no one will get the parallel. That sounds like something you would say and no, I would say no, 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 no sir. I think, I think no. we're on the same page and Kevin's trying to back out of it now. Yeah, I'm just saying, dude, you can poop. This is the <laughs> all over Nemesis. I can poop all over these. Oh, oh here comes the ultimate in. spike. Ah! Okay. Ah, he's away. Off you for a bit. Oof, that's oh. bad lighting. Right I called there. Sarah. You know, didn't know if he'd be okay. Yeah. All right, and we are going to. Wait, stop wait, wait, wait! No, 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 no! I think everything's gonna be okay. And then you put yeah. <laughs> this song. And something I hate doing now. I make fun of Kevin for doing this all the time. Is using just a song that you like as the credit song. And notice how I play the entirety of it because there's still two minutes left. You uh, <laughs> do, you do. And the credits are also it, poor, so, poorly yeah, done. Like I would say it has every single problem yes. that any student It is a perfect example of a terrible student. Yes. And even though it doesn't have like a gun in it, example. it's like we need to have violence. Um, yes. I'm gonna um, talk about things that I don't actually have, have any clue jokes. about. People will get it. Yes. Uh, we do I, experimental I, shots. It's, it's I, a combination I talk about of two things. very I talk popular about movies. mental illness and I do mental illness. And Therapy? It's, yeah, it's it's like something that I-, I Drinking? The writer clearly Blacking has out. a very loose grasp on and has only watched movies about things like that and is just writing from that. Yes. It, it is the short that needs the length the least. Yes. Easily. Yes. <laughs> the oh 22 minutes All right. are egregious. We're moving on. <laughs> what is the mat? Damn with you. I want to attack the Americans. <laughs> I never 
tasted the baguettes in all of our glory. Guys, yes, we've been shitting on our short films. <laughs> It's time to bring it around. <laughs> Children of Liberty is unironically one of my favorite films we've ever made. So what's funny about this one is it's very divisive between the three of us. Uh, because it's the one I directed out of the three of yes. these that we saw. I'm easily the harshest on it. Yeah. Alec is easily the least harsh. He thinks it's awesome. Well, so I, I'm, I'm biased. somewhere very much in the I, middle. I'm I did, very harsh on it, but I also love it. I did almost no work on this one, too. I, I, I was there for writing the script. I arguably came up with the worst idea in the entire <laughs> script. And then I fucked off. I was not there yeah, for Actually, filming. the worst idea that that was put to paper on, in the script, I was out of the room for when you guys came up with it. Were you really? Yes, yeah, I was no, out of the room was. for it. I came back and you guys, and you guys were <laughs> red in the face laughing. We were dying. We were and I was like, what? And the ending was written. The ending was written. It was like, it's we done. Just, and then you're like, what if? Sure. And then I was like, and then I thought it was funny enough that I was like, well, that is actually really funny. We should just end it that yeah. way. Yeah. We got all these shots ourselves. Yes. That's why it says Earth Cam. <laughs>
<laughs> we we were always making each other laugh while writing, but we would always come back around. Okay, that was really funny, but we but can't wait, we do can't that, do that. Can't, this, this one we didn't. We never said that to ourselves. And, and I think a lot of this is just that nostalgia, and also well, I didn't have to be there making. It. Yeah, that was a bone. <laughs> Why is he using the flag as a blanket? He loves the French dude. Normandy. I will criticize the writing. There's no inciting incident here. He just kind of has he a just dream. Has a dream, yeah. And that's not a great inciting no, incident. No, the, inci the inciting incident is that he wants a baguette and he <laughs> wants to leave. We should do it. We should attack. I mean, what, what, what do we stand to lose? Our lives, Pierre. That, I like that line delivery too. It's very grounded. Our lives, Pierre. Yeah. Right. The, the, uh... It's a one. Were those real cigarettes you just put in his mouth? <laughs> and he broke so many of them. And I was like, dude, those are my actual cigarettes. I need those. Oh, <laughs> Bella? I think the baby is coming. Just to give birth on the flag. You son of a gun. You made it. Of course I did. <laughs> a veteran. Of course I did. You son of a gun. Just a basic. <laughs> Since chosen one. She improvised Listen, the cigarette yeah. thing, which honestly, that is a stroke of genius. That 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 was great. Also, she asked us on set. She's like, "Should my character be smoking? <laughs> she's pregnant." It's like, "Yes, <laughs> of course." Wait, one of my favorite <laughs> shots is coming up. Not that one. That was great. Though. This one is. That big. is legit. Really a pretty, pretty, shot. pretty yeah. fucking sick shot. Look, the Americans. They must have known we were coming. They have surrounded us with water. Ain't no thing. We swim in this bitch. <laughs> the baby was supposed to be dragging them in the yes. water, and we just like, we're not shooting back. We, we couldn't do it. We couldn't do it. Backstory for this take. We're here in broad daylight with very <laughs> realistic looking guns. The pitch for this was, I was like, all right, guys, we're all going to show up five in the morning. No cops are going to be awake. No cops. And I, I know I know two of you are minorities and, and will be killed on site if, if you're caught with a gun running around. But we're just going to do it once. Just do it once. We're going to do it once. And then we're going to pack up the guns back into the into our towels. We, no, we literally brought towels to wrap them up and to hide. And then we're going to run out of them. And then, yeah, that's how we, we got the shot. We did it in a single... Um, okay, we had to. What we are about to watch are, to <laughs> this day, some of my favorite squibs that we've ever done. Yes. This part makes me smile every time. Pierre? Pierre, you going back get on me? Gonna make me call these Americans myself. And there's no sound effects of the guy what? being choked. Yeah, it's what? just. I have some. <laughs> we have blown 15 minutes of our life. Well, let me look around for it now. Uh, <laughs> this is the big moment, dude. He finds his baguette. It's what we were. <laughs> we waited an hour. <laughs> I know. I don't know what you guys are talking about. This this short flies by. I do genuinely think that that is the best place for the for that short to end. Oh yeah. So um and, and well, there's an after credit scene. We gotta leave. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> that was a real unedited sound effect. <laughs> yeah, that was of... literally just. <laughs> why did why was that baguette so old and gross? Because we got it for a day and we couldn't shoot it so that day. I listen. So as you can see, we still have not figured out anything. <laughs> the that. biggest thing I think we learned, one, is that apes strong together. We were starting to learn what each other's strengths are and how we work as a Slowly team best, better. Like you you can start to strengths. see us form our collective. And just because there might be either at, at any point in the good. process, anything that we thought was good with any of these three, and honestly, even to, to date, we don't gatekeep those ideas. We're not like, well, these ideas were good, so therefore this is this. We found of learned over the years where it's like we can do a stupid thing as long as there's a point yeah like yes. there, as long the, as that that is what the point is of eternal liberty is just to be stupid at the yes end. Uh, thank you guys for watching uh, if you want us to rip apart your short films leave a little email at uncle mickey productions at gmail.com if you liked this video like. make sure that you subscribe because we're going to be doing more <laughs> stuff like this possibly depending on how many views this gets um,
Mm. We'll see you guys so, next time. See you guys next time. Goodbye. Bye. Mer Merry Christmas 2024. Yeah, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Thanks for joining us.